Port Huron, Michigan, the final race of the 1987 offshore racing season. The green flag dropped, and Bob Kaiser dropped the hammer. It was time to focus his attention on the national championship. The coveted US-1 title could be his if he performed well in this event. Kaiser knew what he had to do to win, and he did it brilliantly. Even though he blew an outdrive, so did his closest rival, John Antonelli. So by finishing fifth in this event, Bob Kaiser would win the 1987 National Offshore Racing Championship. After years of concentrated effort, Kaiser realized his dream. In 1986, he'd been crowned world champion. In 1987, he became US-1 national champion. The number is the new number on the board. That's the new number next year. Yeah. Yeah. All right. <laughs> thank you, George. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, everybody, for being here. Uh, <laughs> my happiest fifth place I've ever had in my entire life. <laughs> there was celebration, jubilation, and what's more, the realization that the years of dedication, hard work, and mental and physical preparation had paid off, and paid off in a big way. His boyhood dream of being the fastest boat on the lake had matured into a man's reality, being the fastest professional offshore racer in the world. Kaiser had won the coveted title of US-1, national offshore champion, but had gained so much more. He had won the respect of his fans and competitors, for his was a complete victory on and off the water.